Hello everyone and welcome back to another script case tutorial. Today we're going to see the fixed column options within the script case forms. So basically script case offers us four types of forms. Three of them are horizontal. So for apply the fixed column options, you should choose one of them. So we can work, for example, with multiple records form, editable grid form, and editable grid view form. So within this screen, we have all the options that I'm going to introduce to you today. The first one is the fixed level option. So basically, we need to click here at yes, and that's it. So let's run our application to see how the option looks like. So this is the label bar. We can use the mouse and scroll down here and as you can see here the label bar is fixed so that's the option let's check the next one so the next option is the fixed columns basically we have yes or no once we enable this option we can go to our form let's have a look here so here we have our form we can pin one or more columns it's pretty easy then we can scroll here horizontally and as you can see, we don't get lost. We can see all the information. And this is really useful, especially while we are editing a field, especially, for example, in mobile devices, this will be really interesting. Okay, going back here to my script case, we have another option here. It's called Fixed Column Hover. So at this point, it's marked as no. So I click yes here to see the difference. So let's run our application. So here we have our form, and if I hover the mouse, I now can see those icons. Back here into my script case, we have this fixed options column. So let's enable this option. Let's run our application. So once this option is enabled, we can scroll here horizontally, and as we can see, the options column is fixed. Another interesting thing is that Actually, the final user can also work with the rest of the columns. However, this one actually got no icon. Back again to my script case, we can go to the sorting options. And I want to show you another uh, new thing that comes with the latest version of the script case. That is the icon type. So we can actually use font awesome icons within our labels. So let's enable this option. Let's scroll down and we can see that we have new icons for the alphanumeric fields or numeric fields. So basically we have uh, smarter types of icons for sorting our columns. So let's enable those and let's have a look. So for numeric columns, I have this one to nine icon. I can click again and it will switch to nine to one and for alphabetic columns we have this a to z sorting icon or z to a so that's all for today i hope you all enjoyed this tutorial so please thumbs up